For what? For your confession. You spineless, gutless ingrate. Annie hates Greenlee, so she purposely guillotined her. And you don't know what Annie did or didn't do. Just let this go. You're defending Annie. Brian defends her. Even Greenlee defended her. So you're not gonna let her go? No, I'm not, because she is an out-of-control head case. This has nothing to do with Ryan and loving Greenlee no, and any of that no, stuff. No, 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 it's not. I'm, I'm, I'm taking your advice, and I'm, I'm not trying to control other people's love lives. Good. Good. So this is about Annie needing serious medication or deep therapy or both. I think she could be dangerous. She could be more like her brother than oh, she lets on. Oh, do that. No, Zach, I can see what you can't. Yeah? You see things that I can't, Yes, right? I can. Listen to me a second. I used to be very angry back when I hated my life and resented everyone who had it better than I did. I wanted to make the whole world pay, including my mom. And I did. So I can detect that kind of rage in other women. And I see it in Annie. We'll talk about it later. Okay, I'm right about Annie. See you at home. Don't work too hard. Bye. Hey. We're building a house? Yep. Uh, How many of these have you had? Um, I don't know. I lost count. Right. Download's done. We're good to go. This program has everything we need to put our house together. Site work planner, floor plan, drawing tools, interior, exterior design capabilities. Amazing. You are amazing. So we put this house together and then we give it to our own personal architect. Do we build him too? No, I hired us a real one. Addison Neville. He's going to finalize the design of the property. But we don't have a property. You didn't. Ten acres, baby. Out by the yacht club. And it's all ours. <laughs> I actually borrowed this from Mr. Andoni downstairs to tighten the pipe under the sink in Emma's bathroom. It's leaking again? I think so. And I don't want to be on that plumber's waiting list again, so I just thought I'd take care of it myself. Where's Emma? She's actually at another sleepover. Another sleepover? Don't you think she's been doing too many of those? Well, this one wasn't exactly planned. She just got really excited because I told her about the baby. You told her about the baby? I know. We should have told her together, but it just kind of slipped. And she got so excited and said she wanted to tell Spike. So I took her over there. Rachel invited her to spend the night. I kind of couldn't convince her otherwise. I'm sorry. I know I should have waited. It's okay. I'll pick her up in the morning, and I'll take care of the pipe. Oh, no, no, it's okay. It's okay. I can do it. No, you need to rest, okay? I'll do it after after my meeting. Meeting? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Meeting. It's not going to take very long. Are you going to see Greenlee? No, I'm not. Why would you think that? I saw you two together at Confusion yesterday. You were at Confusion yesterday? Why didn't you come over and join us? Because I was jealous. I know it sounds so stupid. I know you love me and Emma and this baby. I just, I don't know. I've just been feeling a little crazy lately. Hormones and work and everything. And I, oh, sorry. I told myself I wouldn't cry. You know what? It's fine. Go, go um, to your meeting. I'm being silly. Go. I'll be fine. Are you sure? Yes, I am so sure. Go. <laughs> I know what you're up to, sis. Miss me? They got us. Now I'm gonna tell them that I was the driver. No, don't. This is hurting you and your mom. I can fix it. You are not going down for this, okay? I'll handle it. You know, 
all of this covert whispering between the two of you, you need to be over here talking to us. You couldn't be more obvious. What do you think? We're stupid. We are not the enemy. Come on. Are you kidding? I know you two are not killers. Something went wrong that night. Something went really wrong. Freaked you out. You didn't know what to do. So you decided to just cover it up. That's not working for you really well, is it? You do see that, don't you? And I do want to help you. But I can't do anything with you stonewalling like this. Honey, please listen to him. We will see you through this. Yeah, I'm not doing this anymore. Who are you calling? Calling Daddy. Tell him I'll be on the first jet back to Paris. Cass, hold on. No, I don't want to Give be here anymore. That. Give me this phone. You are not running away from this. You can't make me stay. Actually, I can, Cassandra. I don't want to have to do this, but you're leaving me no choice. Not talking, resisting, baby. You know what? You two, you got to work with us here. You have to trust us. No, I will never trust you again. Either of you. Jesse. Um, you need to do what you need to do. You're not real. You know, you always try to convince yourself that you weren't crazy like me. But conjuring up dead brothers qualifies for pretty insane. Go away. I didn't think you had murder in you. But I guess I'm dead proof that you do. Shut up. And you've picked another target. Still using your weapon of choice, I see. But you've upgraded. Very cool. Hey. Bad time. Sorry. Uh, hi. Um, if you're uh, if you're looking for Annie, no, she's... I know she's at home. I came to see you. Actually, I tried oh. you at home first. What are you doing with this? Oh well, just it fell, so I was just trying to fix it. So, uh, what can I do for you? Why did you finally tell Greenley? Tell her what? That I love her. What are those circles right there? Well, they're the hills. And there's one in particular where the house is going to go. So it's really, it's right up there on the hill. And there's going to be trees surrounding the house, which is going to shield it from the winter wind. And we can watch the most gorgeous sunsets. This could all be real. Yeah. I looked through the gallery of homes, the model homes, and I'll pick one out for us. I hope you like it. And we can change anything about it that you want. All right, you ready? Yeah. Look at this. I told her that you never. I, but listen, I didn't mean to, okay? She was being a huge pain in my butt, and she kept insisting that, that, that I was jealous of Annie, which is ridiculous. And I couldn't shut her up. She wouldn't stop talking, so it just came out. But I, I promise, I, uh, I, I, I promise we I did the best I could, and I covered for it. We ran into each other. The way she talked to me, the way she was looking at me, I knew. I knew that she knew something. And you wish that she said she loved you back. Kendall, stop it. I'm not doing anything. Uh, Greenlee is with Aiden, and I am with Annie. Yes, and she's having your baby. I know that, Ryan. I know who is with who and why. But I also know that you got the bum end of the deal. You're not happy. And you'll never be happy as long as you're with Annie. Uh, is, is Emma okay? Yeah, she talks to Rachel. She's, uh, she's good. Can I come in? You know, actually, I was just about to leave. For a minute? Can I come in for a minute? Come on in. It's just uh, killing time, so... So you came here? To check on you. 